Level up again. Oh my god. That looks useful. Well done. Okay. Pretty funny I'm using a Huapo and Huapo keeps leveling up. Peacock fan. Alright. Huh? What the fuck do I do? Fuck. I don't know how to get to the restaurant. I thought that was where it was. The door's locked. Uh, you know, the exclusive restaurant up ahead. Everyone's saying this. Yeah, how do I get in? So you got to be a member. I'm not a member. How the fuck do I become a member? Shit, I don't know what to do. Nothing over here. Uh. Swing. That was sick. <clears throat> Good work, everyone. Nice. Okay. There we go. So apparently I, I've gone completely the wrong way here. Is this the door? Oh, here it is. Oh. What's this sign for? A members only restaurant, Ristorante Elite. Even you can't read it? Are you supposed to be an English girl? No! That name's like English. Anyway, moving on. This restaurant is exclusive to members. Those without membership card will be rejected. What? You gotta be a member just to eat dinner? That's bull. So where do I get a membership card? Want to dine at a restaurant? Present your membership card now. <laughs> we heard about that thing earlier. What a plant pain. I believe our staff should have explained this to you when you boarded the ship. Apologies for the inconvenience, but may I please check your boarding pass? This is... This is bad. We should retreat. We can't get in until we have the membership card. Where do I get it from? Huh. I'm not sure. Either way, it seems asking around is our only option. We have to ask around for about the membership card. Show me your true form. The stupid guys respawn, which is annoying. Okay. 
Barely bullet. Come. Your mind. Ooh, Joker. You're looking cool. Morning. Good. Goodbye. Let's withdraw. Okay. I don't know who's gonna tell me about the pass. No idea. What's the matter? You're acting finicky. I dropped my card for the restaurant around here somewhere. Aha! Uh -huh. Isn't this a good chance for us? He dropped his membership card. Yeah. We may be able to take it from him if we can find it first. <laughs> How am I going to help you? Has anyone turned anything in? An article in particular? A membership card. Nothing has been dropped mm. off. Darn. <clears throat> Nothing there. Same thing. Anything in? Card. Nope. Mm. <clears throat> Maybe downstairs. I have it. Got it. Nice. That was actually pretty easy. Should it have been that simple? Who cares? It's all thanks to Dick Shido thinking everyone around him is incompetent. Uh, he doesn't believe in anyone. That must be why there are so many membership cards around. It's not bad that it went that quite quick. Let's head to the restaurant. Alright, we're gonna go back. The other down the stairs. The enemy disappeared, by the way. The enemy that was right there. I went the wrong way, didn't I? Yep. I'm gonna go further down. It's confusing because the whole thing looks exactly the same. Every floor looks the same. There it is. Okay. Welcome through, I see your card. One of our targets, a powerful politician, should be at the restaurant. What's your call? Let's head in. <clears throat> Thank you for displaying your proof of membership. Please head on inside. See smart with a blue flower are reserved for special guests, so refrain from sitting there. What? Special guests? Eh, who cares? <laughs> Reserve seat is special information that may lead us to the politician we're looking for. For real? Huh. That possibility didn't even cross your mind. Anyway, let's head in and find a seat. <laughs> Things are pretty damn luxurious. Even the food looks oh super my. good. Try not to get too excited, okay? You're embarrassing us. <laughs> that must be the table. Right. That influential politician comes here. Why don't we have a seat at the table next to it and wait for him? I'll go. He may become guarded if we go in a big group. Okay. Wouldn't it be odd with just one girl sitting there, though? Does someone want to come with me? Skull, Fox, or yourself? I'll go. Huh. Hold up, Joker. Let me go with her. No. I mean, dude, it's a restaurant. What are you, a preschooler? <sighs> I was wondering why you were so excited about this. He's in love with food. Uh, why isn't anyone asking me to do this? 
All right. We're going in. Everyone else stay nearby. I'll give the signal when the time is right. Thank you to Lord Lamb for a 50-bit cheer. Appreciate that. Man, what should I eat? You can't get full off of food in a palace. Uh. He's as dumb as ever. Uh, I can't read this. <laughs> I'll have the sautéed foie gras, a salad garnished with truffles, and roasted lamb, please. I can't believe you can order so easily like that. Say, ain't we kind of young compared to the others here? They're all involved with Shido, yeah? They seem to be major figures in the political and financial worlds. On whose permission are you sitting there, brats? Uh-oh. Whose? Uh, I don't see any reserved sides or nothing here. It'd be a nuisance if you'd make a racket next to my table. Ah, this might be the guy. I wish to dine leisurely. Children like you who are simply hungry should leave. <laughs> what was that? Rubble, rubble. Skull, be quiet. <sighs> Sorry. I apologize for our discourtesy. If you understand, then go home. Excuse me, but might you be Mr. Oe? Indeed I am. This will be an impudent request, but would you provide us a letter of introduction to Mr. Shido? <laughs> From the looks of it, you appear to be minors. Why do you need an introduction? We wish to be granted an audience with him. His political ideology resonates so much with us. Of course, the same can be said about you, Mr. Oe. You have quite the silver tongue for mm. one so young. Not that I mind it. Are you a high school student? No, I'm a dropout, a drug yes, dealer. Sir. Speaking of high schools, I've heard that some principal somewhere kicked the bucket. He supposedly tried to leak Mr. Shido's name. <sighs> Had he simply obeyed, he could have remained in the upper echelons. To think he would cast all that away. So according to him, what he's saying is that the principal was trying to leak Mr. Shido's identity and they killed him. An elite such as myself can't even fathom why someone would do such a thing. If you pledge your loyalty, you're given the honor of selecting those who would have mental shutdowns. Did you ask Mr. Shido to trigger a mental shutdown in someone as well? Ah. Hmm? Ah. More or less. Considering your caliber, I would assume that the target must have been someone quite important. <laughs> important? No. The target himself was nothing that impressive. It was just the CEO of GameStop. That's why he improperly quit the other month. <laughs> oh, you must be being modest. You recall the subway accident early last spring? The one I had targeted wow. was that engineer. What the fuck? Why? That was you? It was to take out the president of some company and a diplomat who sided with current government. I see. That was very useful, Mr. Owe. Hmm? Actually, my sister is a prosecutor at the public prosecutor's office. Oh! I could pass on what you just said to her. How about it? Won't you give us a letter of introduction? Is that a threat? Who are you two? The letter of introduction, please. Uh, Don't get cocky, brats. I'll never give you one. Probably gotta fight him a boss fight or Looks something. Looks like you have one, though. Well, guess it's time to use brute force. Uh. Guys! Whoa! Okay, then. 